If you buy plastic by today, and you can see the case of Kenya, when you travel down from the Jomo Kenyatta to, uh, to Naivasha, to Kisumu, you can really have the feeling, visual feeling, that the environment is more cleaner. And if the environment is more cleaner, and I hope because we have removed those dirty plastics from the environment and from the market, it also means that we have reduced the quantity, the amount of plastic that was supposed to end in, in, this, in the oceans and also to end in our different ecosystems. So this is a quick win. And it's a quick win because each citizen can be part of the solution. If each citizen collects dispose in a sustainable way the plastic that they're generating, either through drinks, either through uh, different activity that they are doing in a daily way, then we are reducing our footprint in terms of plastics. If we can manage to dispose in a very sustainable way the plastic that we are, that we are handling, if we can choose not to use a single-use plastics, if we can choose, for example, instead of having these uh, plastic glasses, to have our cups, to have our mug. If we cannot reuse, if as each citizen, if each consumer can just think twice and say, if I cannot reuse uh, a tools, if I cannot reuse uh, a cups or glasses, etc., then I will not go for it. It will be a tremendous contribution of each individual to solve the plastic pollutions.